Welcome back everyone to another episode of Banished with me, Vapor. As you can see from last time, we still got this nice area here, which uh, I will continue around the corner. I, do you know what? I could put another dock in, but it's, it's such a narrow river. I think oh, the trader coming. Um, I'll probably just put more of this quayside, and then we'll look into some of the other little buildings that you get, um, which I might build on this island and that side. We'll see. But first off, it's good timing. Let's see. Oh, <gasps> cows. Ooh. I'm going to pause that for a second. Now, I didn't really want any cattle yet. <laughs> um, I can't afford it by the looks of it. I'm just about. I'm overpaying, so yeah. You know. One thing you'll find is my mouth is appalling. Um, but hey ho, whatever. <laughs> we get there in the end. Uh, you need additional, okay. So we'll buy these. This is going to kind of kind of knocked me off my uh, my game plan so to speak because I wasn't going to do this but we'll take them but while he's here we can actually tell him to come back with some of these other things that we'll, we'll have next time um, we'll put visit. and we'll go to this person so right we've got this issue with firewood at the moment now we've got plenty of logs but these guys are just not working quick enough so what I'm going to do is put two in each one here and I'm tempted to remove this guy over here we'll see we will see with that one I'm not too sure but I'm going to have to put a pasture down somewhere now for these cows which is um, a, a touch annoying so I wasn't planning on doing it but I should have known there was always the chance that we would get cows or seeds so where could we build them? We need some flat land. Now, bearing in mind I can flatten mountains, we might actually take this area over here. Because so I'm going to expand the, like, the house inside of the town this way a little bit. So, yeah. I guess we need to put a pasture down somewhere. Maybe we'll put one of these new ones down the, what are they called? Transparent fields. Yes, <laughs> I'm going to put one just to see what it looks like. I might not like it. We might get rid of it. Now, this is a bit of a random place to put it. But, let me think. Now, I can't remember how big these need to be. Let's do a 15 by 20. And what, what we essentially need to see here is, um, as, long, as long as it can hold more than 10 cows. Because once it can hold more than 10, I can split it. Or should I say split the herd into another field and obviously the more cows each season that you're killing the, the more you're gonna get that, that sounds really uh, really gruesome and there we are we'll put a quick road in there as well um, I think I said I was gonna put a school in didn't I and we will unpause it for that we will just carry on as normal Thank you for everyone that's been viewing and liking. I, I noticed I had a few likes here and then, and a comment as well. I really do appreciate the support. The support. I, as I said in uh, one of my comments, I am, you know, quite new to this. So you know, the the more you guys like, and subscribe, and comment, I'll kind of know, you know, if I'm doing a good job, a bad job, and you know anything that I'm doing that's annoying, etc. I mean, maybe I want to be slightly annoying. <laughs> I'll put this in. Where's the door for this place? I think it's there. It says tools are at maximum. That's fine. 100 is fine for now. I'm not really bothered about that. But we'll, we'll have the school here. As soon as we start to get a bit of a decent population. And we need to remove this, this thing. It's just in the way for what I want to do. I'm thinking of having things like a, a, the glass works and things over here. And that's going to be potentially one of the next things that I'm going to do. Because food, food's fine. I think, yeah, we've got the maximum gatherers at the moment. I'm going to move this fisherman's hut. I'm going to put a little bit of a, kind of a jetty so it's a bit further out. And I might put some more people in there. But the odds are, let's see the ed edge of this area. See, this is the edge of the, the this forester's lodge 
I'm probably going to be able to, if I flatten this mountain, squeeze another one in here and I can put another gatherer so, so I don't need to concentrate on farms too much, which is good. But I'd like to get some of the new buildings in. Let's see, what, what can we build? Alright. Well, we're going for a normal school, a colonial hall. We do need to build a town hall, actually. Ah, hospital. It's not a new building, but I'm going to build it anyway. I know it looks very kind of straight and everything. I'm not... Although I did say I would try and kind of make it pretty from the start. These few buildings, not so much. But we'll get a, we'll get a marketplace and we'll go around that. I, I may mean to put... Where are they? These new buildings in. But the good thing is, they are... I think, yeah, they're four deep and three across. So, if I just put normal houses in for now, until I can I can actually build them. If you look, these are four deep and four across. So, if I replace them with these, we're going to end up with a little gap between them. But, they'll be cool. We will make it look good. We'll make it work. Right. So, let's have a look at buildings. Well, yeah, food. We could do the apiary for the beer. I'm tempted to put this because this is new. But we haven't got rope, so we can't do that yet. And for rope, we need seeds. And there's nothing new there, really. What have we got here? These are on. What does this actually use? Use salt and leather, so we need salt for that. So we can't really build that. Yeah, I think we need to start getting things like the brickworks up and running. I did want to. I did want to put some of the new buildings, but. It's not really going to be possible just yet, which is sad. So, what we'll do, we'll remove this stuff because, yeah, it's just going to get in my way. Which is it's not, not great, really, because it, it did look nice, but we will build another one. Careful, don't take these houses out. We need to build another barn as well at some point. Them away and them. So we should leave us a nice clear area. Oh, actually, that barn's okay. Reserve of firewood is low. Why is it low? I've put more people in here. I'm not chopping quick enough. We've done the field yet. Nope, well, I'm hoping my cows don't freeze to death. Let's prioritize this one actually. I'm never sure if this thing actually does anything, but I use it anyway. We'll soon find out what's left. Still got to remove trees. We've got six laborers, so really, yes, it's not millions of them, but it's fine. How are these guys doing? Yeah, they've 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 planted trees. Remember, this was a big mountain, wasn't it? And so they're they're doing quite good. And here we are. Let's bring them more firewood in. That's probably why. Yeah, because I've said four thousand, and they've only done that so far. But it seems more an issue with the speed that they're doing it, as opposed to how much wood we've got. So we can put another one in here. Like that. We also need a teacher. You see, we're suddenly running out of labourers. And then obviously, as soon as the school is built, it's going to take a little bit longer for us to get people. But it's fine. And we're going to get a lot of logs from this as well, by the looks of it. Oh, look. I'm paying attention. Ah, see, that is, that is much better, actually. Can, well, look, you can order everything. I'm not going to do that just yet, because I don't need them right now. I mean, actually, what, what's he offering us? Why not check flax? Ah, we need that. I think we can use that for rope. And we needed rope, remember? But let's look for hemp. Not for smoking, either. Uh, where's hemp? It will be in alphabetical order. There we are. Oh, that's herb. Well, we'll take herb, because I think... Remember, memory serves me rightly. You can actually sell herbs to most people, much like you can the firewood. So that might be 
something useful. And we'll we'll go for corn and cotton. Corn obviously makes bread. I, I like the idea of having the windmill and things like that. And cotton we need um, for the sails for the boats, I think. Chili seeds, that's a new one. Right. We'll save that and let's see. Well, we will go for well, walnuts. Walnuts grow on trees, if I remember. But we'll just go for this. Because they're struggling to keep up with the wood anyway. And that's 4,000. So that should be 1,000. I think I can get that one. No? My wood's worth... Oh, they haven't got enough. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say. <laughs> if it's a value of 4, 1,000 would have been 4,000. Well, what we'll do, if we pin this up here. And push this button here. It will keep it there. Until we're ready, so we just gotta wait for the, for the wood basically. How much have they got? 631. Yeah, he could be waiting there for a little while. Ah, I forgot, totally forgot what I was doing there. Oh, yeah, cows. They're taking their sweet old time, aren't they? Oh, that's why. Their, their priority is all wrong. You see, I asked them to build the buildings over there first. But they're removing these things first. I mean, what's the logic? Unless their houses are closer to this. I'm not quite sure how they go about their business. I'm going to pause that hospital as well. Because I don't need that just yet. That's more for when I built the town hall. Nomads will bring disease. Food took a serious hit there. But then again, you know... Coming up to 40 residents, I might have to think about building the forester's lodge up here as well and another gatherer's hut. Then again, do I need a forester's lodge? The forest might grow on its own. We will, um, let's flatten this with the, uh, the people that I don't have available to do it. <laughs> we'll do it anyway. We'll just try and get another gatherer's hut in here. Although, thinking about it, I should build one here. So now let me cancel that. Cancel. Is that one, isn't it? Cancel removal. No? Oh, idiots. Sorry, I've been working all morning. My brain's not fully functioning yet. <laughs> right, yeah, we'll put one here because. There's got to be food. Yeah, there is food around. We'll do it here. That, that would make more sense. Gather us up. I highly recommend these. For, for anyone that's new to the game and is struggling with dying um, on the basis that they run out of food, these these buildings are just fantastic for, for quickness. Put that there. Because, like, farms, obviously, you've got to wait. Till the end of the season until until they uh, harvest the crops. I don't really like that. I'll do it to there. It's not completely flat. And I could see another trader coming round here. Oh come on. What's wrong with these people? Taking them forever. What have we got? Anything good? No. Go away. How are we doing here? Getting there, almost a thousand. Yeah, these guys are probably churning through it now. Oh, look, and they're also collecting food. I think the issue here is they've just got to move it to a stockpile. I, it's not too far. Maybe if I put a dirt road in this way, because they're coming that way, it might speed them up a touch. Although, someone has to build that. Some more firewood going in. We'll get in there. And we can just keep seeing him popping back in. And when all this gets picked up as well, that's going to seriously help. I really need to, um, to plan where I'm going next. This said this building threw me off. Well, we got the seeds now, didn't we? Didn't we buy the flags or did we order it? I know, we've got it, so I'm pretty sure. We can build a ropery. If I can remember where it is. 
I think it's this one, isn't it? Yep. Yeah, see, flax or reeds. Also, I could have used reeds as well because the... I forget the name of the building. Let me see if I can find it. I swear they move these things around. Because sometimes I'm looking and thinking... I'm sure it was here somewhere. What have we got? It's none of those. Ah, oh, there it is. Clay, sand, frogs, turtles. Oh, right, I thought they could do reeds as well. Well, maybe I'm wrong. But what we, we will do, we will... Um, once we got the flax down, we can build the ropery. Because we needed that for, the, for hunting the ducks, wasn't it? I think it was. Where's that building gone? Yeah, we needed it for that. And whatever force you have... I haven't got a clue what that is. Let's have a look. It looks like a flower of some sort. Let's see if I can see it. I'm going to probably go shoot him right past it. Is that it? No. I can't remember what it looks like now. <laughs> sure it looked like a flower. Sugar cookies. Hmm. I don't know. We'll cross that bridge when we come to it. How are we doing here for the seeds? There we go. So. 1,000. We'll take that. And you can now leave. They're still removing all that material. Madness. I'm going to speed it up a little bit because I feel like it's dragging a touch. Right, there we go. This area is a bit clear, so I'm going to drop the speed down. And I'm not going to let them build the buildings just yet, but I'm going to start putting them down where I want them to go. So we can see the layout and see what you guys think about what I'm going to do. I need to cancel that one. Where is it? Cancel removal very white isn't it it's coming a little bit right so i think along this shoreline we will build the building that i always forget what it's called <laughs> this one the shore houses might be a bit too close um you can't really build a key side with these because it just doesn't look right so i think we'll build them along here and i can see me putting a nice key side around this area let's have a look yeah, you can build them quite, quite close in. I think they've changed where you can place them as well because it seems much easier to place them like that. So we'll put one there. I'm going to do two of each. And two will do sand, two will do clay. The clay is for the bricks and sand is for glass. But we'll pause them for now. Like that. We might come and remove the resources ready. And we will need for that. Let's have a look. Right, so there's the brickworks. I'm only going to build the one for now. Because we don't need too many. But it's just a good idea to build up a, a, a quite a quite a few of them for later on and that will be classed as material so we will need to increase this and it'd be a good idea to have a pretty big stockpile in here somewhere maybe just limited to materials so no one else dumps like trees and things in there now this is here so i can't build too close but oh look at that they've put a path right through it so i don't have to go all the way around it i'm gonna turn it around anyway Sure, I think I might build it in there. And we also need not a melting house. Which one of these is glass? Is it that one? There we are. So I can't build these until I have some of the materials anyway. We might build them opposite each other. Yeah, I think we will. And we also need, and I did this wrong last time, it's this... Uh, I think I built 
the stacks burn it by a mistake, but you need this because this is the fuel that powers these. I think they turn firewood into a into, into a, like a more intense form of fuel. We'll put that there. Do you know what? I've not actually paused these things, have I? Oops. I'm on more than like the end of the house. Oh, that's annoying. Do you know, I wish things, <laughs> I wish things would level out sometimes, but they don't. It's gonna be a slight overlap. Although, I could use that area for a stockpile. Maybe just to keep the houses over this side for now. Maybe we'll put one there. We'll pause that as well. Stockpile. I keep clicking all the wrong buttons today. It's this one. Stockpile. And it was materials, wasn't it? Yep. So if we build that there. Well, let that build, actually. It's not a big problem, that is it. And we'll put... Oh, okay. It's okay, so you can't actually build there. That's fine. And I think we could build straight through here, which we'll do. About there. Okay, so that's that. So this will be like the next step. But these guys need to be built first. Got another trader coming in there, and we've got this. So we need to put in right seven, eight. So that means both my gatherers' huts are full now with well, literally everybody. I'm gonna leave one there in case somebody dies. All right, we need to see what this trader's got, and we need to sort these cows out. But that will have to wait until the next episode. So until then, take care.